ROM which is available for most of the devices based on Android 11 of course not available on Android 12 we're gonna talk about this build and let me know in comment box if you already got this which is this custom ROM I'm talking about as I just mentioned, it's not available based on Android 12, it's only available based on Android 11, which means better stability compared to all Android 11, all Android 12 based custom ROMs and it comes with some features for you too, I'll talk about that. From the default launcher, most of you will definitely got to know which this which custom ROM is this one and if you still didn't got it, make sure you are in the custom room community of course this custom room has this launcher pre installed and only this custom room has this custom this launcher pre installed called shady launcher which comes with some cool customizations talking about the quick settings panel has a lot of extra tiles available for you if you move on to the edit icon a lot of tiles available here which you can add or remove which is quite good as i just mentioned that this room has a lot of customizations and features for you one thing which I just noticed here, unfortunately there is no phase unlock available. I'm not sure as I'm using its unofficial version, but it's still based on official one. It does not have the phase unlock. That is a little bit disadvantage, but app locker etc. is working. From here, definitely you got to know that which custom room is this one. And if still you didn't got this, bad luck for you. I think it's quite easy for you. This is what we have configuration center where you have some customizations for you. Status bar related customization, gestures, quick settings. A lot more things are available here. Quick settings where you can customize the rows and columns, of course. Lock screen has a double tap, status bar, etc. Gestures, ambient displays of also available here for you. Navigation related options, gestures, which means full screen navigation, gestures, etc. Everything is available. Notifications, alerts, etc. Which means almost all the useful things which you need in a device, everything is present here for you. Looks quite good. All the useful features are already present. There might be some issues with those features or some features might not work for you if you use other devices or if you have a device which does not support Havoc OS. Yes, I just mentioned that this is Havoc OS. If you still didn't got it, it's bad, but I think so. All you already got this that this is Havoc OS based on Android version 11. Looks good. As I just mentioned that this is Havoc OS. The version which I'm using here is 4.13 with the general security patch. Looks quite good. As I just mentioned, it is available for most of the devices. So if you have any of the device, this room should be available for you. If this room is available, make sure to check out. This was all from today's short and simple video. Link is in the description to install this build. Official website link, of course. So this is all. Thanks for watching. I think so. You like this video. If you like this video, don't forget to like and share this. I will see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye. Take care. Like I'm floating through the air